All right, what's up everyone? Welcome to the Surfside PPC YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna to be going over target impression share bidding. So it's a new bidding strategy that Google Ads just released and you can actually bid for certain positions in the ads results. So if you look at my campaign here, you can see impression share is one of the columns I have here and it's showing less than 10%. So what that means is that my ads have shown for less than 10% of the total searches for the keywords that I'm targeting. Usually you'll see impression share is higher than this. Uh, anything lower is always gonna say less than 10%. Uh, so just to get started with it, what you want to do if you want to use it is click on your campaign, come right to settings. You can also come up to the top of tools here and go to bid strategies under shared library and create it there. Um, but what we're going to do is under bidding here. So click on it. You can see I'm using an, an existing portfolio strategy. So what I want to do is from the drop down, click on target impression share. So it's going to say, where do you want your ads to, to appear? You could say anywhere on the results page. So that would be any ad on the front results page. You could do top of results page. That means you're in the top portion of the results page before the organic listings or the absolute top of the page. So you can use any of these ad locations depending on what your goals are. But let's just say we're going to do top of results page. I want a percent impression share of 50% and my maximum bid limit is $5. So that's all you really have to do and you can click save. Um, there's a lot of different reasons why you'd want to do this. For example, let's say you're a real estate agent in Miami. So let's go over the ad positions again real quick. So you have anywhere on the results page. So that would include any of these ads. And then also down here, this ad or any of the ads at the bottom. You could do top of results page. That means you're just in one of these top five positions that they have here. Or absolute tops, so that would be this ad position right here. So you're bidding for one of those. If you're a real estate agent, you might say, okay, you know what? I want to be at the top of the search results for a specific set of keywords at least 50% of the time. So that what that's saying is that you're going to be ranking up high there. And there's so many different ways to get clients when it comes to real estate, when it comes to different types of industries that it might be worth it to actually target impression share. Because even though conversions are really the most important goal, make sure that your ad is at the very top often so that people can see your ad, people can find your real estate agency and you can get more clients can be really important, especially when things are get really competitive in the ad results. Uh, so another example here, so New York criminal defense attorney. So let's just say I want this absolute top position. So absolute top of results page, I want it to be there up at least 50%. You're probably gonna have to set your max CPC bid limit very, very high to do this. So for lawyer, um, for any of these types of very competitive industries, you might be looking at a bid of $30 as a maximum CPC bid limit. You might even need to increase it a little bit depending on the keywords that you're targeting. But there's a lot of different reasons why you'd want to use target impression share. And basically, if you know, if you look at my impression share for this campaign, it was under 10%. So maybe I say, okay, I want target impression share. I want to be at the top of results page. So in those top top results up here. I want to be in one of these ad positions up here, let's say at least 75% of the time. I want people to find my ads at least 75% of the time. I would say the max CPC bid limit for me to be able to do this would be probably around four to five dollars, depending on what everyone else is bidding. And then I would just click save. And that's it. So target impression share bidding, a new bidding strategy that Google Ads just released. You can test it if you want. Um, again, I always recommend using the bidding strategy of target return on ad spend or target cost per acquisition. Um, those are the two that have given me the best results in any of the campaigns I've I've ran. But in very competitive industries, I could see why target impression share could be something that's worthwhile, especially for certain keywords. Um, so give it a test if you want. Uh, it's a new bidding strategy. Uh, if you have any questions, you can leave them in the comment section. Thanks for watching our video today and make sure you subscribe to our channel.